we explain the psychological effects of racism. Today, many doctors and scientists are attempting to understand the psychological effects of racism on individuals. In the U.S., racial discrimination has a significant impact on African Americans. Not only can racism manifest itself in the form of hate crimes and police brutality, but also in the form of psychological trauma and distress. According to a 2017 survey from NPR, 92% of African Americans said they face racial discrimination in the USA. As mentioned, this takes on multiple forms and can be a daily occurrence for many. Research from Dr. Karen G. Martinez for the Anxiety and Depression Association of America shows that black Americans are 20% more likely to report psychological distress and persistent depression than white Americans. As such, they endure a disproportionately higher burden of disability due to mental health struggles. What's more, black Americans are more often at a disadvantage when it comes to equitable access to resources such as education, housing, and health care. These disadvantages are linked to anxiety disorders, which one in four black Americans will experience, according to Dr. Tahira Abdullah and Dr. Jessica Graham Lepresti. They indicate that, quote, Black Americans are not responsible for the existence of racism, but are unfairly burdened with the responsibility of coping with the painful existence of these oppressive experiences." End quote. This burden presents itself in the form of anxiety, anger, and sadness, or as Dr. Abdullah and Dr. Graham Lopresti refer to it, racial battle fatigue. The doctors offer a few methods of coping with this fatigue. It begins with knowing your self-worth and surrounding yourself with people who value you. When faced with racism, Dr. Abdullah and Dr. Graham Lopresti recommend being compassionate with yourself. Anxiety, anger, and sadness are understandable reactions, but it's important to externalize racism rather than blame yourself. Acceptance of your emotions does not equal your acceptance of racism. Ultimately, we must all be conscious and respectful of the psychological burdens that others may carry. It is as crucial for us to value one another as it is to value ourselves.